Welcome back to my channel. Guess what we're doing today? Unboxings. As always, once a month I receive my two monthly subscription boxes, Birchbox and Ipsy. Let's start with Birchbox. Ah! Mm, I'm trying to be dramatic, but I can't do it. Fungal, open. I still can't do it. See what's going on. Eight June 2004, 2014, 2004 is the year I was a senior in high school. Um, away we go for summer. How nice! And as always, they have the um, as always, they have the contents of the box and their full size price on the back of the card. First things first is I have a Jergens BB Body Perfecting Skin Cream. And it says um, there's no like actual color. It's like all light skin tones. Um, and this must be this must be an extra because it's not on the card, which is kind of cool. Um, but there's only four. I don't know four. Okay. Anyways, I receive a lot of BB creams, and it's one thing that I really don't mind getting because. I like to try different things, especially the BB creams, because they intrigue me. I have a little sample of the Caudalie Anti-Wrinkle Defense Serum. Full size is $62, which is... Ooh. It says an oil-free antioxidant serum that evens out and plumps skin while preventing wrinkles. Then I have a Laca & Co. Uh, Lip Lube Pencil. <laughs> Full size $18. And this color, can I find a color? Minotaur. And it's just like this really sheer uh, purple, purple pink. I do not like the way these smell. All of these lip crayons, they smell like peppermint. And for some reason, I just don't like the way that smells. Let's open up the little box, shall we? This is a perfume. It's by English Laundry. Full size is $90. And it's signature for her, inspired by English Gardens. This charmer balances floral and woodsy notes. Another thing I really don't mind getting in sample sizes. Ooh. I really like that. It's really light, very floral. And it comes in, it looks like a lip balm really cute. Next I have a little sampler of a palette from Coastal Scents. It's the Revealed 2 palette. Full size $34. So to see how they packaged this for the sample. Very good for blue eyes. It comes with a bronze gold, a really dark brown, a more light bronze, and then a highlighting shade. This palette is supposed to be kind of like a, a cheaper version of the Naked palette, so... Shadows feel okay, they're not super great, it's close to sense. And you get what you pay for, but... Still, I do think that the Urban Decay palettes and other like premier um, cosmetic companies, they overcharge for some of their stuff, so... Moving on to Ipsy. Pretty in Paradise. And this month's bag is very cool. It is signed by, I'm gonna mess up her name, Rebecca Minkoff. Um, so good job, Rebecca. It's very kind of floral. It's little pineapples. First thing I pull out of the bag is a DD cream, 15 benefits in one by the brand Derma Doctor. Self-adjusting coverage. It smells weird. No, I don't like the way it smells. It feels nice, it's nice and moisturizing. Hmm. 
you know that's you know what smell I'm talking about if you ever use a self tanner like a couple of hours later you stink that's what that's what that reminds me of next we have be a bombshell lash out mascara this looks like a full size we get a lot of stuff from this brand, don't we, Nipsey? Mm. So it's a nice, sleek packaging, um, a matte finish, and then the brush. Just like a generic mascara brush. Oh! Oh! No. Oh, it smells like paint thinner and jalapeno peppers mixed into one. Not pleasant. Next one, I think it's called Nick AK, Nick AK um, Cosmetics. It's a green shimmery liquid liner. It's like an emerald jade green. Um, the brush is very stiff. It's, it's like a plastic. I feel like with plastics, you make more like a mistake. I feel like plastic brushes on liquid liners are harder to manipulate. So I'm gonna try this out and let you know how I feel. I have um, a Mark Anthony Beach Waves Dream Wave Spray. I've actually wanted to buy this, so I'm really happy that I have this. Create sexy tousled beach waves all year long. It smells delicious. With this perfume, it smells like pineapple. Very exciting. And this again is a good travel size. I broke it. Fixed it. Lastly, in my bag is a NYX Butter Gloss in E Eclair, which is um, one of the colors that I've been wanting to get. I just don't have, so I'm really happy I got this one. As you guys know, I'm just obsessed with these butter glosses. The um their pigment their like pigmentation is beautiful. It's like a perfect sheer pink. They smell great. You see that? Wow. It's gonna be tough to see. It's just like a true pink, which is beautiful. If you haven't tried those NYX butter glosses, I highly recommend them. They're about four or five dollars. Super affordable and just beautiful. They have beautiful selection of colors. I want them all. So that's the end of the video. I hope you liked it. Please give it a thumbs up if you do. I think Ipsy won again this month. And they usually do. For some reason, I can't bring myself to close to cancel a birch box. I just can't. For some reason, I'm like, well, what if I miss a really fantastic month? Be sure to comment down below and tell me what you got this month in your subscription boxes. Um, what you think I should try out which company tell me down below um you can follow me on a lot of social media websites such as twitter facebook instagram tumblr it's all linked down below i hope you're having a great week and i will see you in the next video i love you bye